My name is Michael Rakowitz. I'm a professor in the Department of Art Theory and Practice at Northwestern University. My work encompasses everything from drawing to sculpture to installation, but it is mainly rooted in the public realm. So I've done work in public space since 1998. And then there's also an institutional avenue of my work that looks at the history of objects and also art during war as a method of combating cultural amnesia and cultural erasure. One ongoing work for over 10 years now has been The Invisible Enemy Should Not Exist, wherein I, along with a team of assistants, uh, reconstruct the more than 7,000 artifacts that were looted from the Iraq Museum, and also archeological sites that have now been destroyed by different militant groups like ISIS. When I was asked by the City of London to submit a proposal, I looked at the blueprints of the fourth plinth and it was 14 feet long. And at that time I'd been researching the Lamassu that stood at the entrance of the Nurgle Gate in Nineveh, which had been destroyed the previous year. And that was 14 feet long and so immediately I saw it as being almost made for it. And so this one stands outside, looking back towards Nineveh, with its wings raised, hoping to return one day in the future. The Invisible Enemy Should Not Exist is about not necessarily replacing what's gone, but looking at the measurements of each of those objects and reconstructing them using the materials of cultural visibility that one finds throughout the United States where there are Arab populations. The Lamassu is being reconstructed not of papier-mâché the way that most of them are, but using the tins of Iraqi date syrup, which I have here in my studio. I don't want to exoticize what happens when cultures meet. I think cultures can meet. Of course, there's differences in language and in customs and things like that, but what I find is that most people are ready to get rid of the hierarchies that seem to have alienated people you know, in the previous century and even before. I hope all my work in the future becomes obsolete. If I never have to reconstruct an artifact, it will mean that all of them have somehow turned up. I'm an optimist, but I'm also not quite as naive to think that that's going to happen. But that's kind of the implied challenge in my work. I can't make other things right now because these things that have disappeared kind of need their ghost.